Galnet News Update, 11th of January 3310. Senator Zamina Torval is planning to become the next Chancellor, according to the Imperial Herald. Torval recently returned to the Senate following an extended leave of absence, during which she transferred ownership and control of all her businesses to her family, with her daughter, Constantia Torval, now in overall control of the mining, haulage and slave trading enterprise Torval Mining Limited. While she was absent from the Senate, one of Torval's other daughters, Petra, who is also a senator, temporarily took over representation of the Sintani system in the Senate. Senator Petra Torval has now stood aside to allow her mother to return. The elderly Senator Zamina has promised that she plans to remain in the Senate for many years to come, scotching the rumours that she was about to retire. At 132 years old, she has seniority in the Senate, and political journalist Cassia Carvalho believes this may be the key to Zamina's return to public life. With rumours that the equally venerable Anders Blaine, who was appointed Chancellor to run the Empire on behalf of Emperor Hengist more than one quarter of a century ago, is thinking of retiring. It may be that she hopes the role of Chancellor will be retained, and that she, by virtue of her advancing years and consequent wisdom, will be appointed to be the Emperor's closest adviser, responsible for the day-to-day -day administration of the Empire, while Emperor Arissa, who at 67 is almost half Senator Zamina's age, lives it up like the stripling she is. On the face of it, the Emperor seems unlikely to trust her one-time rival for the throne enough to appoint her to this senior role. However, the politics of the Empire are rarely straightforward, and it may be that inviting Torval to participate more closely in government will help prevent schism. <laughs>